guess that the uh, the plan for for 2017, to be honest, is is to try and you know win again. Obviously, um, I've never successfully defended a title. I finished second both times I've been here after winning it the year before. So uh, getting a back-to-back titles are, are pretty pretty special little achievements. So I'm going to try to aim for that. The first year of sponsorship with Bwise obviously went exceptionally well with us winning the title at the first attempt. What are the targets? Well, much the same as last year, really, but maybe to win even more races. So. We've had a, a learning year now, so for this year it's more uh, a gloves off approach. Um, you know, last year I respected everybody around me. Probably, probably you know too much to be uh, ultra competitive, but you know now I deserve to to be on that track every bit. This is what they do, and they got to take it off me this year. Is how I see it, and we, we're going for that showdown. How's this year's bike different to last year's bike? Honestly, right this second. It's not. <laughs> it's got some different brake pads in it. Um, however, the team have been working really, really hard, and um, you know some of the stuff that was meant to have been here a long time ago has literally just rocked up today. And I kid you not, I mean today. I know there's a, a raft of development, you know, in the pipeline with you know, various components that you know will be a benefit. But for now, it's the same. But uh, we, we have to look how dominant the the Beweiser Ducati was last year, and the same bike from last year is not a bad thing at all. Paul and I have read terms for, for two years. Um, it's basically because we're both here because we want to be, you know. Um, I have a lot of respect for Paul because at the end of the day, he doesn't have to throw his own money at, at motorbike racing. You know, he's got plenty of other commitments, but year after year, he chooses to, you know, to support the team and, and you know, fundamentally to support me. We've had a lot of success together in the past and uh, hopefully we, we're still due a fair bit more together in the future. We have to up our game this year and obviously we've been working really hard over the winter and Shane's been working hard on his fitness and so has uh, Glenn behind the scenes. So this year two of him on a super bike he needs to improve again for this year and I'd look to be racking up more rostrums and see if he can grab that elusive first win. I've had a couple of, of you know tough components in the past. I mean obviously in 2015 it was Josh and he beat me and you know Leon ran me close last year for the for the championship but I never, never ever look at my rivals, you know, I couldn't care less who's racing against me, it's just concentrating on the, on the job at hand. Message from my fans would be, keep doing what you do, you know, I, I get quite a lot of support, um, especially via social media and, you know, it seems to be a popular thing now is uh, the selfies and, you know, keep doing that, I'm all for it, it's nice to be able to interact with you guys and without the fans there wouldn't be a British Superbike series and without the series I, this wouldn't be my job, so, yeah, thank you. BYZ Insurance sponsors the Paul Bird Motorsport British Superbike team.